Okay guys, welcome to my video. This is how to get out of Balam under lockdown. And I'm also going to show you the individual reactions you, you get from uh, the different characters when you finally enter Zell's room. Uh, you can enter his room during this time because the hotel's off limits, and each character has something different they say. So when Galbadia Garden occupies the town of Balam in Disc 2, you tell the guard that you have information on a loan and he lets you in the town. However, if you try to leave, He'll say you need authorization to leave this town, and he won't let you out. He tells you to go report information on a loan. So, in case you were in the middle of doing something and you just wanted to check Balam out, now you have to finish the tasks in Balam before you can leave. Uh, but there is a way to get out of the town. So to do that, you need to go into Zell's house and head off to the room to the side here. And you'll talk to Ma Dinch first, and you notice that there is a kid in the uh, lower right hand corner there. So Zell just talking to his mom. And now we're just gonna get a little plot because this dialogue is mandatory. And if you're not at this part, basically Reg and Fujin are the bosses that you have to fight uh, when Balam's under lockdown. So once you get control of Squall and the party, go talk to this kid right here. He's the big bad rascal, he's gonna Tells Zell he's been practicing a special move, and he's going to do a kick and talk to him again, so you got to talk to him twice. So he says he's going to go check things out. Just talk to his mom real quick. And she says drag him back if you see him. So now what you need to do is you got to leave Zell's house, and you want to go talk to... Um, the guards outside the hotel. This is what the uh, guard at the front of Balam tells you to do uh, when he lets you in. So you're going to pretty much demand that you're going to want to see the commander. And after some uh, dialogue, they're going to tell you show the captain respect and that the captain is on uh, patrol. If you haven't figured it out yet, the commander is Fujin and the captain is Regen. So this is actually a pretty easy section of the map because you just got to find Regen and that's fairly simple. So once these guys finally tell you to show respect to the captain, you can continue on. Okay, so captain's on patrol. So what you want to do is you want to run down here to the uh, boat launch that you took for the seat exam. Just do a quick loop. For some reason, it's never worked if I don't run down to the harbor. So we're just going to run back up to um, the houses. The little hobbit hole uh, houses they have here in Balam. And this house right here, next to Zell's, is the um, hotel owner's daughter is located inside. So you're going to talk to her. Mommy and Daddy haven't come back. She can't take it anymore. And in case you didn't know, those were the two people that were standing uh, at the entrance to Balam not being let in the town. And she's their daughter. And she's crying, so you step out. Because you don't care about children and comforting children. And you run back in. And there's Big Bad Rascal who's trying to comfort her. So talk to him. Don't cry, I'll sneak out and check on him. And he says he's faster than a speeding bullet, he can outrun anyone, and he'll run out the door. So now what you need to do is you need to go back up to the uh, initial screen where the guard is. And you need to talk to him. And what you want to do is you just want to keep this um, speech bubble open. And what this will allow um, to happen is Big Bad Rascal will be able to f talk to the... Uh, father of the hotel owner or the hotel owner the girl's father I should say right there he's going to tell her that she's safe and what they're going to talk about and it's just kind of annoying and once he finally runs back you can run back inside and big bad rascal is going to thank you yo Zell, thanks man so he was able to distract the guards next time I'll take care of everything just give me a holler when you want to leave town so just talk to him again. Want to leave town? Yep. And just select your party. And you see that now he is distracting the guard by talking to him, which allows you to leave town. So there you go. That's how you leave town in Final Fantasy um, VIII when Balam's under lockdown. Uh, in case you want to do some ability point grinding or you want to complete a side quest. And then when you run back in, just talk to the guard. And you can say either either one lets you in. So say you let us out, 
And apparently he's dumb. And just lets, up, lets us back inside. And now if you need to uh, leave again, remember all you gotta do is talk to Big Bad Rascal. Okay, so now what I'm gonna show you is because you can't go into the hotel right now in Balam, uh, you don't have any place to rest. So just try to run into Zell's room, and Zell will finally say, eh, we can't stay in the hotel, I guess I have no choice. And now each character has a specific um, thing that they say when uh, they're accompanied by Zell and Squall into his room. So I will show you all those now. So first we will go with Renoa. So we're going to go to his room and rest. And he still is not a fan, so we just run up to his room. So this is Zell's room. And Renault's gonna go check out the weapons, and we're gonna have to talk about Zell's grandfather. Just kinda maintained his composure and stayed cool. And Squall with a zinger there. Renoa tells him he's being too cool, and there's a lot. They uh, have a laugh about it. Zell says, "Show more passion," and that's it. Um, you can save right there if you need to. So I'll be back with the next reaction. Okay, here we go. And now this is uh, the scene you get when you let Irvine into Zell's room. So, Irvine's not really fond of being in another guy's room. Uh, but one thing that he is fond of is the rifle collection. Whoa, what is that? These are some of them old school rifles. And Zell, of course, tells him not to touch because they're his grandfathers. Irvine still states that they're really cool. And Zell, who feels pleased, says, okay, you can go ahead and check them out. And Irvine, being Irvine, is going to pick one up and fire it. <laughs> And Squall just internalizes his thoughts. And that's what we get with, with uh, Irvine. Next up will be Quistus. Okay, and now with Quistus, it's gonna be story time in Zell's room. So first of all, Quistus says uh, she didn't think it'd be that clean, and then she notices the tea board that uh, was supposed to be confiscated uh, right before the Forest Owls mission. And Zell pretty much states that because of his own personality, you gotta have more than one. So now Quistus is gonna tell us a story. Zell wonders what's so funny. And Quistus remembers something. And no, we don't know about Zell's famous incident. What incident? While Zell was riding his T-board in the hallways of Garden, made a sharp turn, went straight into the woman's restroom. <laughs> so that's the scene you get with uh, Quistus, and up next and last will be Selfie's scene, which I think is probably the best one in the game. So now we're going to look at the scene if you choose a Selfie as a third member of your party to go to Zell's room. So, you're going to walk into the room, and Selfie's going to bump into Squall, I guess, or just flop right down on Zell's bed. So yeah, it looks like a little sexy time action in Final Fantasy VIII. Zell gets mad, says don't touch anything, and now you're on my bed, because he can't take the hint. Either that, or he just doesn't like that Selfie doesn't have pigtails. So, she'll get mad, I didn't think you were so anal. And yeah, Zell, you should feel honored that a very, very cute girl sat on your bed. So she's going to ask Squall's opinion, and you actually have two options. So first, if you choose, no, you're annoying him. Zell's going to say, yeah, stop annoying me, and Selfie's going to get more angry. So she says, you think I'm an annoying person? And she's going to take a look at both of them. And tell us we're both going down a rank. Um, whether or not this actually drops your seed experience, I don't know. Because every time that I've uh, done this, my seed rank is the same as I start. So now let's take a look at the other option. So if instead you decide with Squall to choose, maybe you're right. Zell's gonna get indignant that you're siding with Selfie. 
Selfie gets a little happy and just flops right over on the bed saying Zelda doesn't understand anything. So, like I said, Selfie probably has the best reaction in the game. Um, that's all the reactions you have from the various characters that you can take into Balam with you. Uh, if you like this video, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button. And if you be so kind, I'll subscribe because I'll be releasing more videos. And if I get enough interest, I'll actually do a Let's Play where I can show you how to just thoroughly bust open the mechanics of this game uh, really early. So, as always, thanks for watching.